Hello everybody, Shadow here, and welcome to Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door. This title theme is jamming. Uh, <laughs> it is launch day. Uh, ideally, this will be coming out the day after. Um, I just, I really enjoyed the first game, and so I happened to line it up exactly, so that way I could get this game right away. So, we're gonna just dive into it. From the beginning, let's start. I don't know if my camera's in a good spot, so we might have to move it. But I just, I, I, <laughs> I try to go into this as blind as possible. <clears throat> Today, I'm going to tell you the story of the Thousand Year Door. All right. An awfully long time ago, in a strange and far off land, a big, bustling town thrived. It was a town where all people lived very happy lives. And it was said that the town was very prosperous. Oh, hello. But one day, tragedy befell this blessed place. A great cataclysm struck the town and its people. Oh, no! Darkness filled the skies and the earth roared and shook. And it was as if the very world had come to a violent end. And in but a single night, the town sank into the depths of the earth. Oh. Oh my. Many moons rose and set. Stories of the town passed into the pages of fairy tales. And when the town's site no longer held relics of its past, people gathered at that spot and built a new town. Okay. But word soon spread among the people who moved in that an ancient city lay deep underground, and that a magnificent treasure rested there. Okay. Cool. Indeed. This is the tale of the fabled treasure of Rogueport. Yes, this is where it begins, in the sea town of Rogueport. Uh, the tale of a quest for the legendary treasure, and the thousand year door starts here. Okay. Cool! Very, very nifty. Oh, hi, Peach! Finally! I have a minute without Toadsworth watching over me. He's so paranoid. I come all the way here on holiday, only to be stuck with Toadsworth. It's so stifling. Once in a while, I'd like the chance to look around on my own and see what I want. But now that I'm doing it, all I see is that this town has a very, um, distinct flavor. Oh, Missy. Missy. Hi. Won't you buy something? I have a wide assortment of knickknacks and doodads, but this is a special favorite. Well, that's a pretty box. What's inside it? This box holds a map that shows where to find treasure. But the box has a magic lock on it that will only open for a pure and noble heart. As you can see, it won't so much as budge if one such as me touches it. Oh. If the box will open for you, Missy, then you may have whatever is inside. <laughs> Go on, hold it. This feels like a trap. I suppose I could try opening it. Oh my! Hey, it's our home! Hey! Buddy! Mail call! Oh, hi, Luigi. How's it going? Hey, bro! Check it out! A letter from Princess Peach has ar arrived for you. Okay, okay. I'll just read it to you. How's that sound? Ahem. Now let's see here. Okay, okay. I can't read that. Hello there, Mario. 
I am now on holiday, traveling in the Mushroom Kingdom. In my travels, I came into possession of a, my a mystical map. A treasure map, actually. It was inside a box I got from an old merchant in a town called Rogueport. But since it would be too difficult for me to try to fi go find treasure all by myself, I thought you could help me hunt for it. You will, of course, won't you? I've included the map with this letter, so please bring it with you when you come. I'll meet you at Rogueport. That means you must come. Peach. Okay. Cool. What do you know? It's true. There's a weathered old there's a weathered old map in here with the leather. Check it out. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Right. Right. Fascinating. And off we go. Okay. Cool. Cool. <laughs> Uh, I've I've heard so many things about this game, and I'm like, I can't believe I'm actually playing it. <laughs> Prologue, a rogue's welcome. Okay, cool, sure. I love a good prologue. Ah, I can press A. <laughs> I thought I was gonna transition on its own. Excuse me, sir. Please wake up, sir. The town you'd been speaking of has come into view. Look, that's Rogueport. I don't know if this is a proper voice for this character, but I don't care. Okay. You see? We'll arrive shortly. Please prepare to disembark. Okay. Did I really sleep through all of that? Beep, beep. Here we come. I must apologize, sir. Our arrival was delayed just a bit by rough weather. Are you quite sure you want to disembark here? I did tell you all the sordid tales about Rogueport on our way here, did I not? Yeah, yeah, it's fine. What's that? I'm sorry? You say there's a princess waiting here for you. Is that so? Uh, of course, sir. Well, if that's what you think, then I won't stop you. But, uh, you be careful, sir. Don't say I didn't warn you. Okay. Um, oh. Ta-ta! <laughs> okay. Hey, welcome to Rogueport. Bit of a nasty place, eh? You got guts coming here. You look a bit green, so I have a wee bit of advice on me. Hit that save block to save. Because the thing about life is, you never know when you're going to kick the old bucket. Fair enough. Okay. Ta-da-da-da! Hey, bud. What do you want, pal? Huh? A princess in a pink dress? I ain't seen nothing like that, no. I'd remember a princess. Probably. Why do you want this chick anyway, pal? Oh, your money? Or is she your girlfriend? I don't know if I like it here. Hey, what do you want? Get away from me, freak. Oh, come off it. You know you're a nosy book nerd, so don't play dumb with me. I know you're... I've seen you walking around town asking for information about the Crystal Stars. Well, now I'm doing the asking. So be a good little student and tell us what you know, right now. Never. I don't have anything to say to you, creeps. Ew. I suppose it wouldn't be right if a sassy little lass like you met with an untimely demise. Buh, 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 buh. Boys, we're taking this firebrand to our fortress. As you command, Lord Crump! We're on it! Your name is Lord Crump? <laughs> no! Stop right there, you weirdos! I'll scream! Really? Huff, huff, hot, ruff, ruff! Out of the way, you scallywag! Move your ever loving bones! Hi! 
like I'd go anywhere with smelly losers like you. <laughs> Not likely. What? What do you think you're doing, chimp? You think you can screw up my plans? Oh, I feel like I've gotten in the middle of something. Yeah, it's always something. Looks like I'm gonna have to give you a little taste of the old crumpa bomb. Oh my! All right, you wanna tussle? I'll tussle. I, I know I can't flee this fight. Why did you tell me I can't flee the fight? Battle time, Mr. Man. Just find a way to beat this freak of the week, okay? But don't sweat the details. Just jump on him and hit him with your hammer. How do you know I have a hammer? All right. Gah! Sweet. You know that hurt. Wow, I gotta say, you're tougher than you look. Keep it up and you'll beat him in no time. Oh. There we go. You've got him on the ropes. Come on, keep wailing on him. Would you like to help? There we go. I was pre I pressed the wrong button on the first time. There we go. Get out of here. I got nine star points. You did it, you did it, yes. And you got star points. That's what these little things are, star points. Okay, all right, yeah, yeah. The star points you get will show up there. When you get 100 points, you'll go up a level. Don't forget that, okay? Right. Oh, yeah. yeah. Buh, 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 buh. Okay, you got a couple decent shots and I'll give you that. But unfortunately for you, that means it's go time. Oh my. Punish him. I've changed the voice. <laughs> oh, good golly, gophers. Quick, this way. Okay. Phew, what a bunch of bozos. Let's just sneak out of here. What do you say? Sure. Okay. So I can access my gear and the journal. Can I spin? Can I not do the little spin anymore? Maybe I gotta get a badge for that? <laughs> Stop! Where'd they go, huh? You, Johnson, did you see them? Did anyone? Uh, crud, they bolted. I'm never gonna be consistent with voices. I promise you that. Wow, mister, you totally saved me. Thanks. I just, I have just got to give you a little reward. Oh my. What are you guys doing? Stay back. My name's Goombella. I'm a junior at the University of Goom. Nice to meet ya. So, uh, who are you? You don't know Mario? Mario? Oh wait, you mean like that famous guy? Wow, I can't believe I met you here. Cool. Anyway, no offense, but it looks like you just rolled it in town yourself, right? <laughs> oh my! Oh! Me, I already hate it. Stay down, bro. The boss is sends his regard. How's that toad taste punk? I don't know. Are you okay? That hurt. <laughs> Those jerks. We won't forget this. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Me, I already hate it here. Uh, there are freaks and weirdos everywhere. It's nasty. I mean, I know the place is called Rogueport, so I should have expected it, but sheesh. I'd never come to a place like this if there weren't some legendary treasure here. Oh, you mean that? What? You're looking for the legendary treasure too? Seriously? 
Whoa, 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 Paco. What do you got there? A map. Oh my gosh, is, is that a map? You have to tell me where you got that. I got it from Peach. Princess Peach? What? Great hoogly boogly, if it isn't Master Mario. Bit of a coincidence, bumping into uh, one another in this sort of place, hmm? Ho ho! So tell me, Master Mario, what in the world brings you to this wretched little burg? The princess. Hmm? Ah, indeed! Princess Peach sent you a letter and a treasure map? And she told you to meet you here in Rogueport? Intriguing! Oh, yeah. yeah. Where is she? You're asking me where Princess Peach is? Um, I was about to ask you that. We stopped in this town to acquire a spot of fuel for our ship, don't you know? I only took my eye off her for a moment, but as soon as I did, she vanished. Oh no! You know how headstrong she is, Mario. I just assumed she'd be back momentarily. But at this point, I fear we must embrace the possibility that she may never return. Oh dear. But I'm feeling better with you here, Master Mario. Surely we'll find her, surely. But I know my place, Master Mario, and this is not it. I leave this task to you. Me? I believe I'll recline in the inn right over there and enjoy a spot of tea, perhaps. In fact, I highly recommend it, particularly if you're finding your HP running low. Just drop on in! <laughs> yes, anyway, a little rest there will fill all your HP. I must say, though, the rest of this town is a bit rough. Yes, rough indeed. Okay. Huff, I'd say. Huff, I say. Um, the Princess Peach? Did he mean, like, Peach the Mushroom King Princess? The princess who always gets nabbed by Bowser the Koopa King? The one you rescue? Yeah. Wait a sec. This is wild! Princess Peach sent you that treasure map? Uh-huh. Whoa! This is really intense. Well, where could she have gone then, do you think? You think maybe she got sick of waiting and went to find the treasure on her own? Hmm. hmm. Oh, oh, I know, Mario. Come with me. One of my professors is here researching that treasure. We'll show you, we'll show him your map. If we start looking for the treasure, then maybe we'll find some clues about Princess Peach. Sure. Great, we're all good then. Let's go, Mario. Goombella, join your party. Goombella's abilities, a primer. When you approach people or objects, you may see an icon appear over Goombella's head. If that happens, you can press X to learn more about that person or object. Okay. Press X to learn about a person. That's uh, Goomther the Goomba. He's always complaining about being swindled or mugged. That feels very rude. <laughs> Press X to get information about nearby people, places, and objects. Press X to learn about a location. This is Rogueport Square. It's the center of town in the main business district. It's a crossroads between uh, where many people meet, including more than a few shady characters. Okay. Sometimes you'll learn uh, some interesting tidbits. Try using her ability whenever you wherever, whenever you can. That concludes this little primer. Uh, do you think you've mastered Goombella's abilities now? I've mastered them. Of course, Goombella can be quite helpful in battle too. She can jump to attack with a head bonk or look up enemy, enemy HP and weaknesses with her tattle ability. Okay. First off, we gotta go find my professor. The thing is, since I just got to town myself, I am... Um, don't actually know where he lives. His name is Professor Frankly, and he looks like this. Oh, before I forget to mention it, from here on, if you ever feel lost or confused, try pressing ZL. That'll be my cue to share any info I know, which might help us, uh, help us out, help us figure out what to do next. Studying pays off. It really does. It helps your reading comprehension, which I don't have. <laughs> I'm looking into this guy who defrauded me with a fake credit card the other day. If you find that jerk, give him a wallet for me. Okay. 
Howdy. Freeze! You two, not another step! Don't come this way! Some complete jerk just bumped into me and made me lose a contact lens. I'm looking for it right now, so don't you dare move! You hear me? Whatever you do, do not move an inch. Not an inch, you hear? <clears throat> ah! Idiot, you stepped on it. My poor contact lenses. I told you not to move. Don't your stupid ears work? What were you even, what were you thinking? This is your fault. Now I have to buy a new, new contact lenses, but you're gonna pay for it. Compensate me, Mr. Clumsy. Me? No way. Fine, if that's your plan, then here's mine, you oaf. I'm gonna block the gate to the west side until you bring me a new contact lens. Okay. This feels like a scam, but you know, could be genuine. Okay, can I not spin? I want to spin. Okay, so so X is to get information about the area. ZL is to get information about um, our objective. <laughs> Professor Frankly, actually, I think a guy by that name lives over on the east side. Just go east from here. As you enter town from the harbor, just hang a right. So, uh, what about him? Did this guy steal something important from you or what? No, not at all, actually. Um, nope. I've played too many RPGs that have X as the, uh, in, uh <laughs> menu button. <laughs> That's gonna not get confusing real quick. Oh my! Oops, pardon me, sucker! Hey, what's your beef, pal? Yeah, I'm talking to you. The guy bumps into you and just runs off like that. Unbelievable. Some people are so rude. But that's my money. Maybe I should just buy some stuff <laughs> so that way they don't steal more money. I, I, uh, oh, shop points. Okay. Customers receive one shop point for each item they purchase, up to a maximum of 300. Save enough shop points so you can get prizes, including some rare items. Okay. No, I'm, I understand. Sure, I'll just buy a couple items so that way. That way if we get more stuff, more money stolen from us, we should be fine. I like that it tells me how many items I have. Hi. Dang. Yesterday, I blew through 100 coins in the parlor. You believe that? But not next time, man. I'm coming back a winner. The odds favor me now. Right. Oops. Ah, uh, fancy meeting you here. You're pretty dang persistent, buddy. Oh, what a pain. Fine, fine, okay, you got me. I'll give you your coins back. Here. Perfect. Let me give you a news flash. Even the innocent looking people in town are thieves. So don't come grumbling to me about losing a little pocket change. Okay, buddy? <laughs> I don't like you. I don't like you at all. I can crush the bugs. Anything over here? 
Listen, this is a huge secret, but I gotta tell someone. I'm a wanted Goomba. I was a thief in another town up until about three months ago. Yeah, good one. But then the heat came down and I needed to hide out, so I came to Rogueport. Now that I told you I'm lying low in, the thie in this thieves' den, you gotta keep it a secret, okay? <laughs> I'm so sly. Well, I suppose let's head back to the uh, right side of town. Can I not get that? I want that. Okay. Star. Oh, hi! To power up your partner, talk to me from the other side of the table. Sh sure. Welcome to the home of Merlon, the super magician. I foresaw your arrival. I can aid you if you wish. With three shine sprites, I can power up your partners. Of course, that means I boost their attack power, but I also throw in a new move for free. So, which partner would you like me to power up? I don't have shine sprites, actually. Return someday. Okay. Hello, hello! Oh, hi! There you are, Professor Frankly! What's up? Who's there? Who wants me? Ah, yes, you. Now you are. Uh... Wait for it. Just a, just a moment. Don't tell me now. Silence. I'll get it right. Um, it's not Goombriel. Ah, uh, it's not Alyssa Goomb. Mm. Uh. I've got it! You're Goombella, aren't you? You were in my archaeology class last year, am I right? Wow, yes, sir, that's me. I'm Goombella, a junior at U Goom. Go Goombas! It's just Goombas. I don't know why I said that weird. Uh, of course I remember you. Not to toot my horn, but I'm pretty good at remembering. You, though, you stick out in my mind because you were such an exceptional student. And that guy behind you is... Ooh! Mario! Professor, he's Mario! You know, the famous one. Oh, my apologies. I'm such a bookworm. I haven't, I haven't a clue about what's hip right now. In any case, what sort of errand brings you to all the way to a place like this? We were hoping you'd tell us about the legendary treasure said to be below Roadport. I thought that if anyone knew anything about it, you would, Professor Frankly. Of course I know about it. The reason I came here was to study that very subject. But why do you two, why do you tykes want to learn about the legendary treasure? You know that most say it's little more than a fairy tale, don't you? Archaeologists and historians have to search for truth in those fairy tales, though. Me, I believe the legendary tre treasure truly does exist, and I really want to find it. Good point, and well made. In that case, I'll cooperate with you however I can. First of all, we should start by addressing just what the legendary treasure is. Some say it's an infinitely vast treasure hoard, while others say it's a magical item. Some books say it's actually a monster, while uh, some still others claim it's an empty chest. So many different theories. Obviously, it's impossible to divine the truth among them. But all agree on one point. To find the treasure, you, one must have the crystal stars. The crystal stars? To find the treasure of yore, take the seven crystal stars to the thousand year door. That's how the old saying goes. And with a rhyme that solid, it must be true. Therefore, if you want to find the legendary treasure, you first must collect the seven crystal stars. Oh, hey, I researched some of the written lore behind the treasure, and it kind of matches that old saying. Hold the map, hold the magical map aloft before the entrance to the thousand year door. Then the stars will light the way that leads to the stones of yesterday. The stones of yesterday? Is that referring to the same crystal stars you mentioned? 
trust me. And we're in luck. It seems the Thousand Year Door is located somewhere beneath this very town. Yet the cri critical piece of the puzzle, the magical map, is lost. If only we had that map. You mean this map? But we do have it, Professor. Or, well, not we exactly. Mario has the magical map. What? Really? You, you actually have it? Could I just take a quick look at it if you don't mind? Here you go. Astounding. This is it, the real thing, the one and only magical map. You, son, are my hero. You're great, fantastic, wonderful even. With this map, we can locate the crystal stars just by holding it up in front of the thousand year door. Right on, Professor. Good golly, what are we doing just standing here then? Goombella, Mario, let's take the magical map to the thousand year door. Off we must go this instant. I'll lead the way to the sewers underneath the town. All right. Well, um, with that, I think that's actually probably a pretty good place to stop for now. So next time, we will be going to the Thousand Year Door. So look forward to that. But for now, that is it. So thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed this episode, please let me know down in the comments below and maybe leave a like. And if you want to catch the next episode as it comes out, go ahead and hit subscribe. But for now, that's it. So see ya.